Landfills put off a gas called methane as the trash decomposes, but that gas can be put to good use. We're working for you on what our local landfill is doing to help the environment. Smith Gap Landfill in Salem is smelly. Big trucks come dump trash that's compacted down and then covered up. These wells are for methane gas that causes the stench. The Roanoke Valley Resource Authority is hoping to one day turn that smelly gas into something that's actually usable. Methane gas is a natural gas. CEO Dan Miles says they're under a regulatory requirement from the Clean Air Act to limit the amount of emissions coming from the landfill. Miles says methane gas depletes the ozone layer much more than other things. About 20 times what you would normally get from uh, from just your uh, from your cars and your vehicles. So from a standpoint of reducing the ozone layer deterioration, you get a bigger bang for your buck taking the methane from a landfill and extracting it and controlling it than you even do from an automobile. Miles says methane gas is a natural gas. It's just like the gas that comes out of your pipeline. The only problem is it's got some contaminants in it. So the issue is trying to find what is the best beneficial use for being able to extract that gas from this natural environment and be able to turn it into an asset. And that's exactly what we're looking to do now. We've been looking to do that for quite some time. The EPA says landfill gas can be captured, converted, and used as a renewable energy resource. They say that helps to reduce odors and other hazards associated with the landfill emissions and prevents methane from migrating into the atmosphere and contributing to local smog and global climate change. We have more from the EPA on WSLS.com.